eh, Mungu ampumzishe miongoni mwa wema. Naam, uh, ni taarifa nzito ni rafiki yetu na tumezungumza naye mpaka hapo jana kwa hivyo kuna kuwa na ugumu kidogo wa kuwasilisha taarifa hiyo. Tukiachana na hayo basi twende katika upande wa ukufunzi soka hapa nchini Kenya. Shirikisho la kandanda hapa nchini Kenya FKF limeanzisha rasmi mafunzo yale ya ukufunzi haswa upande wa kinadada katika eneo bunge la Uriri na huko zaidi ya wakufunzi hamsini leo wamejitokeza kupokea mafunzo hayo huku viongozi mahiri wale makocha kama Twahir din naibu kocha wa timu ya taifa soka Harambe Stars akiongoza shughuli ile na akitoa mwito kwamba kuna vipaji vingi vya kinadada katika soka, kucheza, marefari na hata wakufunzi na ametaka wazingatiwe zaidi tunapokwenda siku za usoni. Every person that has attended this coach will come out as a qualified coach, whereby he or she is going to be certified through a certificate. And by that one, they are going to be marketable. They are able to now to coach from the uh, grassroots up to Africa, the entire Africa. So that would be a plus. Hayo mengine ilikuwa tunafuata Nairobi, Kisumu. Lakini pia kuna moja ilifanyika Migori. Uh, nadhani some two years back. Lakini ilikuwa na limit. Tulikuwa tunaambiwa ni watu kumi. Lakini nashukuru sana mheshimiwa Mark na na na, na, na director Migori kwa pamoja na FKF. Saizi tumepata idadi kubwa sana. Tuko hamsini. Mtaftaji ya choki bwana na siku zote yule ambaye anachajua utamu wa taji utamu wa pesa yeye ndio yuko katika mstari wa mbele wa kuzitafuta zaidi na maanisha vihiga queens malike hawa walioshinda taji la ligi kwa soka nchini Kenya upande wa kinadada 